Your doctor has recommended that you have a colonoscopy, also called a lower endoscopy. It is a procedure to examine your colon. This video will help you to understand this procedure. Let's begin by reviewing information about your body. The colon is the large intestine where digestion is completed. Water is absorbed and waste becomes solid stool. The rectum is the lowest part of the colon. During a colonoscopy procedure, the inside of the colon is inspected for problems. The procedure is used for both colon cancer screening and diagnostic testing. The American Cancer Association recommends that colon cancer screening start at age 50 and continue every 10 years. Patients at high risk should be screened sooner, especially those with inflammatory bowel disease or a family history. African Americans are at a higher risk and should start screening by age 45. There are many ways to screen patients for colon cancer. A colonoscopy is the most complete screening method for colon cancer. The entire inside of the colon is examined to look for polyps that may be removed, preventing some colon cancers, and suspicious growths that may be biopsied for early detection. A colonoscopy can also be used as a diagnostic procedure to look for a suspected mass or abnormality and to investigate a symptom or complaint such as belly pain, bloody stool, constipation, and diarrhea. A colonoscopy procedure is done using a long flexible scope. This is an instrument with a light and camera at the tip. The scope makes it possible to see and operate on hard-to-reach areas of the colon without making a cut or incision in the skin. Tools such as scissors, graspers, and cautery can be used through the scope to biopsy, remove abnormal tissue, and stop bleeding if needed. Your doctor is searching for dangling pieces of tissue called polyps and any other lumps or worrisome changes to the colon. If biopsies and tissue samples are collected, they are sent to a pathology lab for examination. Before the procedure, you will do a colon prep to empty all stool from your large intestine. The prep usually starts the morning before the procedure with a clear liquid diet. Laxative medications to flush out your stool begin later in the afternoon. An enema may be recommended. Your prep details are based on your situation and your doctor's preferences. You will need to be prepared before starting the prep. Read and understand your prep instructions, especially when to start. Have clear liquids available to drink, nothing with red or purple dye, and have your prep solution laxatives and medications ready. After starting the laxatives during the prep, you will have many liquid stools that should become clear and watery. You will need to stay close to a toilet. Soft flushable wipes and Vaseline can be helpful if the skin on your bottom becomes sore. If you have difficulty with the prep, let your care team know before the procedure. The effectiveness of the colonoscopy can be limited by stool that has not cleared and can hide problem areas. You may be advised to reschedule and follow a different prep. Also, the shape of a colon can be too long or curvy for the scope to get where it needs to be. In this case, a different test may be recommended.